Hello everyone, it's Rosetta here. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be working on the uh, hashtag, hashtag Our Crafty Patch on the side challenge for October. It's one of the Facebook groups that I'm on. Um, I think it's hosted by Wendy. Um, I have to check that. I'm not sure if it's actually hosted. Um, by Wendy. Now Wendy's got a, um, a channel. I will link her channel down in the description box of this video. Now her channel is Creating with Wendy so let's get started. So what it actually is is stamping on fabric and making tags or uh, journal cards using uh, the stamped fabric and you know sewing I think as well um, around them I think if you've got a sewing machine, uh, so um, and if you don't, you can just um, do the mark making uh, for the sewing. Um, so let's get started. So what I've got here is I've got my, I don't have a lot of fabric stamped on fabric, but I do have um, these left. So I will be looking through these and um, choosing. Um, and what I thought was, I love doing these, if you've, if you've seen my channel before, I love doing these master boards just on um, scrap paper. And I recently did this master board, um, so I'm going to be using that. And I've cut one already out. I was going to use it as, um, as a tag and I thought, well, I'll, I'll do it for this video. So I've already cut one out. Um, but I will be using that. I'll be cutting it out and I'll be using the... Um, the fabric stamped fabric and I'm also going to be using uh, some maybe some vellum or some tissue paper that I've printed printed on not vellum uh, printed on um, tracing paper and printed on some tissue paper so um, yeah craft with me um, hope you enjoy and let's get started so what I'll do is I, I can start with this one first because I've already cut it out anyway um, I think it's it's big enough to be a journal card. I think I've got a journal card here. Uh, yeah, it's pretty big. Okay, good. It's big enough to be a journal card. I've got to actually um, put some... I've got to back it, but I won't back it yet. I'm just going to... I won't bore you with that. I'll just start um, the process on what I'm going to do. So my fabric... Um, now, I don't know if this is... I think it's linen. It was a... Um, I think it was a tablecloth of my my mother-in-law's, an old tablecloth of my mother-in-law's that I've just, it was really old and faded. There's, you can see a little bit of pattern. Um, I'm not sure if you can see that little pattern uh, on, on it. There's some, some purple flowers. Um, here we go. Some purple flowers. So I've just stamped on that on the other side. Um, so I've got these. Let's have a look and see what I can use. Um, I've got leaves. Mm, no. It's a bit big. Could use that one. It's a contender. Here's another one like that. Oh, it's funny, I just remembered. When I was doing this stamp, <laughs> every time I'd rip the fabric, I'd ripped the stamp in half. That's twice I did it and I ripped either side. Very strange. I don't know why it kept doing that. I keep these little threads as well for when I'm, um, like if I'm doing a tag, I'll keep these little threads and I'll just sort of, you know, do a little thread thing with, you know, thread bunch. You all know about that. Oh, here we go. Let's try this one. I love this one. I haven't used it for ages. Hmm. I think it's too big there. Uh, how about we try it this way? Hmm, okay. Oh, I like that. Okay, because it's still showing the background of the um, of the card, but it's sort of just sitting there. That's nice. And what I'll do is I will glue it and then sew around it I won't do that yet but um, okay I'll 
I won't stick it or sew it until I'm actually um, happy with what I've got. But I'll just put these away for the moment. Um, and I'll see if I can use one of my... I hope everyone is well. Um, it's good to be back doing some videos. I've changed my uh, workspace a bit and um, I like that too. That's good air contenders. Um, I've changed my, my craft area. I've got a bit more room. I used to have the um, like the arm of the camera thing in front of me, but that just took not the arm, sorry, I had a tripod and it took up a lot of room. So I bought one of those arms that you just um, clamp on to the desk or, and I've got some shelving that I've clamped it on. So it's coming down and I'm using my iPad instead of my iPhone. So hopefully the sound's better because the iPhone that I was using, was it mine? It was my daughter's old one, even though it's an XR or whatever it is, iPhone X is something. Um, I think there was something wrong with the volume. It kept going up and down. I might use one of these flowers. Mm, that looks a bit too big. Um, I, I printed these on um, on tissue paper. Um, so I haven't cut them all out, but I've cut some out. Here we go. Here's a smaller one. Oh, not that one. I stick to the... Oh, that's better. Let's have a look at that. Oh, that's nice. Mm, maybe. That's nice. Oh, look, it looks like that's the branch <laughs> is coming out of that. Um, don't know if I like that or or that. What do you think? Can you tell me? <laughs> It'd be nice if you could tell me. Um, I'm not sure if this one's too big. Oh, that's nice too, though, isn't it? Oh, decisions. I hate these decisions. I really do. Oh, I don't know. I really like that. But is it too big? I, d I don't want to sit here all day. Um, oh... Which butterfly, girls? See, that one's nice too. It's got a different... I really like this one. I don't know. Okay, I'm doing that one. I don't care. Uh, I do care. But I think I'm going to do this one. Um, yeah, I'm going to do this one. So what I'll do is I'm going to stick... Um, stick this down using... Um, just like a, um, let's see, what are these called? Glue stick. Just grabbing a glue book. I can find it. Uh, on. Okay. Just grabbing a glue book. Um, haven't looked through this magazine yet. It's the October. Coles is one of the one of the shopping major um, supermarkets. Coles and Woolies, and they give you three. These three um, magazines, and I use them for. Um, I might use this back page because I know I'm not gonna. You never use the back. You never see the back page, and never really are interested in any of that. So I'm gonna glue this down. And I, I know this glue won't work wonderful but it'll stick it down so then I can at least sew sew around it
Okay, that's good enough. Stuck down enough. Um, okay, what I'm going to do is take this away. I'm going to sew around um, the edges and uh, sew around the edges of here and then I'll come back because this will be glued on after I sew everything because I'm not going to sew over the tracing paper. So I'll be back in a moment. Okay, I'm back. Um, I've stitched around. I stitched around like nice and like just messily um, with sort of like a straight stick and did zigzag stitch and then I stitched around the actual label. So I'm quite happy with that. So I'm just going to put the butterfly on, stick that on. Now I'm going to be using glue stick, but I'll probably also use like a, um, this is like for fabric. It's a three in one sort of, um, it's a craft glue that I get from, what did I? I get it from a place called Spotlight, which is just a fabric haberdashery place. Um, um, so that's what I use. It's the it's the one that smells, so I know it's going to stick. But what I'll do is I'll do the glue stick first, and then I will go around as well with the with the other one. I've forgotten if I asked if everyone was well. I hope everyone is well. Um, I'm doing okay doing better feeling better emotionally <laughs> um oh this is kind of hmm, that's not going to work is it maybe i should just stick it down first like this yeah and then it might actually stick and if it does um let me just grab a card up here uh, so what I'll do yep it's starting to come up so I will I'm just going to put my different glasses on so I can actually see better hopefully it's bright enough um, I'm making this video a little bit late in the day um, I just had so much on today and I saw Wendy's video and I went oh I have to actually do my own video. Um, it seems like it's sticking there. Okay. Oh, maybe it's going to come up. I can see. Yeah, so I had a lot, I've just had a lot on um, today. Uh, my daughter's recently got her full, not full license, but her pro provisional license. So in Australia, we have the learner's license. Um, oh, what's going on there? We have the learner's license, um, which you always have to be accompanied by a full license dri driver when you're learning. Um, and then you sit um, a practical exam that goes for probably 40 minutes uh, we drive around with an instructor so and she passed that her first go which is fantastic so she's got her provisional license which means she doesn't need anyone else in the car with her while she drives um, so she's been driving around um, she's 17 and a half um, <laughs> She's been driving her friends around. She's been driving her school to school. She's in year 12 now, the last year of high school. Um, so she's been driving to school. She's driving her sister to school, who's two years younger than she is. Um, so um, we hardly see her, <laughs> which is a good thing and a bad thing. I'm just going to ink, ink this. Um, 
Just going to grab, grab some vintage photo and do some inking. So yeah, she's um, she's very pleased that she that she passed first go, which is fantastic. Um, we're pleased also, but she comes with that nervousness of um, and she has her own car. We we purchased her a car for when we knew she needed to learn. It was a um, one of my husband's uh, clients. Um, was selling her car and um, it was an old Toyota so we purchased it really cheaply and it's one of those cars that you don't worry if she gives it a bit of a scrape um, so she's got that and it's a little little car you don't have a lot of people in it which is good um, so that's my first tag I hope you like that I like it um, so we can do another one um, I think if you want to do another one we can do another one um, let me put that one up there and I might just cut straight up here first with the scissors and then I can use my cutter if I can find my cutter here it is I can use my cutter I don't want them too much bigger than this I will be putting them in my journal um, and this is my journal here uh, so um, don't want it any bigger. Um, let's have a look. Let's see. You could use it as a um, a pocket um, or even a flip. I know that's the other side, but I will have um, uh, what do you call it? Um, coffee dyed paper. Um, on the back of that, I will do that. I should have actually done it before I stitched it, but that's okay. All good. It's all good in the hood. Um, well, here we go. Let's have a look and see. Yeah, that's a good size, I think. A little tag. And that's good tag. I might actually have, I might put another couple of um, uh, pages because it's quite flimsy and I like them to be a little uh, sturdy. But I like that. It'll go with, and it'll go with the um, the sort of colours of this journal that I've made. Um, I haven't really done much with it, but <laughs> um, I will. I'm just a little bit slow. I have created a couple of things to go in there, but um, so we'll put that aside, and we we create this one. So what do I want to keep in here? I like this, so I'll keep that. Um, yeah, I like that too. So I might get my pencil. There. way first because I know this is a straight line okay. and I where was there the line it's gonna say I forgot my eye forgot my line the other line I can't see. Let's have a look. Oh, there's the other line. Okay, so I'll just mark it again.
Oh, there's the line there. Okay. Sorry, guys. Okay, perfect. Now, oh, it's the other way around. All right, that way. Now, what can we do for this one? Um, the number. Number. Not into that. What about something like that? Then I have to look for what I'm going to put here. Actually, instead of that, what if? Oh, it's not in the crown. Okay. I don't mind that because really there's nothing here um, that I'm too um, stuck on anyway. I love these. I love this. These markings, so I want to keep those. Um, if I put two. Okay, we'll start with that and then we'll see. Um, there's some green there, so I'm just going to grab my vellum, my vellum, and like that. have a huge amount here. Um, uh, oh, okay, hold on. I've got this one over here that I was going to use for um, Is that too close to that? I don't know. Um, <clears throat> I like that, but is that too too close? I like that butterfly. Um, I might see a flower. Nope, don't like the flower. Um, okay. So, guys, um, Um, I don't know guys, I don't think that is going to work. That crown. I like that because the green sort of, I think I like that one better than that one. I think. And yes, it does look like the other one, but not really, sort of, but that's okay. Um, well, it's okay for me. <laughs> um, you know, you got to do what you like. 
Um, I like that. I think that's really pretty. I like the markings at the back behind it. Okay, so what I'll do again is uh, glue this down. So we'll use... Okay, I like that. Yep. Okay, I'm going to go and sew around this, and um, and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back. Um, I've sewed around, so I'm just going to cut this this off. Red. Because the she's going to go there anyway, so you won't see that thread. So that's fine. Okay. Keep this thread. Alrighty. So, what I might do is this around the edges first so it doesn't curl up and then put glue stick everywhere else should have done that first time but you live and learn that's what makes crafting so fun you just learn from your mistakes and um, you fix them up I might even just go all over it with this. I know it's going to stick if I just do that. Okay. That's what I should have done the first with the first one. That's all good. Okay, happy with that. Okay. I could maybe a little... little oh, I haven't uh, inked. <laughs> Sorry. Just ink around. And I won't bore you with the back, but the back would just be plain anyway. But I might back it. Um, I might even back it with some... Um, Sturdier cardstock, sort of plain. Um, okay. Okay. Just put my tools away. Okay. So there's my two. I'm going to, I might actually do some, um, I might put some tags on it. Let's have a look. I've got tags here. I've got these drawers that I have all my tags in. Um, I've got different colours. So, with this one, I might play on the greens. And this one, I might actually do like a, a pale, what's it my you can do a brown but um, yeah okay well, we'll just see okay so this one I'm going to play on the greens so I might I'm going to grab a green and I think it can oh that's nice um, okay that's a contender um, black and white maybe here Ooh, 
I like that. Me likey. Down here. No, I like it up here. I like that. Just saw that and I thought, hmm. I do like that. Okay. Or even, oh, even just a black and white one, do you think? No. Nope, 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 nope. Okay. So what do I do with this green? Green, green, green. All right. What am I looking for? Maybe a number? Maybe just a number? Mm. Maybe this, nature. This is one of Tracy Fox's ones. The others are either Tim Holtz or um, uh, some I bought from, I got from AliExpress. in the background too much. I like that. Um, that one or this one. And it's Venezuela, huh? My uncle's from Venezuela. Um, well, he's Italian, but he lives in Venezuela. So I don't know if I should do that one. I might. It's got some red in it as well. Um, it's either that one or the Tracy Fox. What about something big? Nope, pulls away from it. Nope, okay, I'm going with that one. It's got some markings on it as well, so it looks fine. And I'll go with that one there. I think that is enough. I'm not going to do two. Should I do two? Oh, so bad. No. All right. I'm, I'm just going to do those. Oops, away. Okay. All right. Put this one down first. I don't know if that's a sticker, actually. Is that a sticker? I think I got from AliExpress, it doesn't matter, even if it is a sticker. Sorry, I'm just going to... I've already put the glue down, so never mind. Sorry, my tummy, my tummy's rumbling. I haven't had dinner. Um, and it's probably dinner time, I'm not sure. The girls have already eaten. They... Um, went somewhere after school um, so usually when that happens I just don't bother either about dinner or I just have a sandwich or something it's good I don't have to cook I welcome it right down here. what do we have here I don't think that's a sticker is that a sticker it's another one from both of these from AliExpress actually I'm pretty sure these are stickers. Um, yep. It is. I knew it. Okay, here's a sticker. Okay, that one's probably a sticker as well. Um, that's fine. Okay, okay, I'm back. Um, just after, I just wanted to show you that how I backed these. I just backed it. I actually got some uh, card. Um, there was like pamphlet sort of. Um, it's a thicker sort of card. So I put that, and then I put um, copy dyed paper on on the back. So they will be going into my journal. Um, I think as an actual flip because I like how sturdy it is it's if you can hear that it's nice and sturdy so I like that and you could either, either put it with put it like a, a journaling card or 
it could be a flip just use some washi tape and um, create a flip which is lovely so I just wanted to show you that last little bit thanks so much for watching um, thank you Wendy uh, so visit uh, go visit uh, Wendy's site crafting with Wendy and if you'd like to um, join our join the Facebook group uh, our crafty patch I will put a link below and um, to that to Wendy's uh, tutorial and also to the Facebook group so um, I hope you enjoyed that I thoroughly enjoyed that so um, have a wonderful day so it's bye from me bye